I've paddled everywhere from the Boundary Waters in Quetico up to the Arctic Ocean. I'm Dr. Craig Hill, and I'm from the Mechanical and Industrial Engineering Department here at UMD. I'm really heavily focused on renewable energy systems and observations in the marine and atmospheric environment. Um, my background is actually in marine renewable energy. How do we optimize systems to harness energy from uh, waves or river currents or tidal currents in our oceans? Yeah, we're, we're looking into um, understanding the, the energy resource available in the waves on the Great Lakes. We're starting to look into the example of, you know, these big storms that come in in our, in our gales of November that we typically see here in Duluth. During those large storms, there's enough energy to power homes. If I were a superhero, what power would I have? I think it would probably be being able to survive underwater. Prior to coming here at UMD, I was actually the research, development, and product design engineer for Werner Paddles. They're based outside of Seattle, Washington in the Pacific Northwest. And so I got to design and send to market a couple new products for the company. I grew up a paddler, as I mentioned, um, and so they were looking for somebody who understood fluid dynamics, had a love for paddling, and knew how to design composite products. And so it was a perfect fit for me for a couple of years. If I were to tell a student why they should come to UMD, um, I think it's definitely a mix of on-campus and off-campus life. On campus, we have such great departments in all different fields of science and engineering and liberal arts. Outside of UMD, Duluth is just a great city to live on. It's unique to live on the shores of Lake Superior. Um, we have great access to the outdoors and, and unique spaces along the North Shore Lake Superior. So it's, it's hard to beat the combination of on-campus and off-campus life. 